are in arena. Investigate. Um, I'm not sure if this is private land or not. It's really not marked out as such. But what I mostly wanted to show is just this little church sitting out here in the middle of middle North Dakota. And not a whole lot has apparently gone on here for quite some time. It's a beautiful looking church. Um, at some time in the future, I may actually find out if there's a way of getting a hold of whomever might be a caretaker and see if I might get permission to go inside, but I wouldn't do that at the moment. It's a beautiful cross at the top. There's actually a lot of interesting features pretty much in this whole little grouping of buildings, none of whom I think have been occupied for quite some time. Um, and we'll just kind of go through them one by one. Here's the absolutely gorgeous old church that apparently just isn't there. There's nobody using it anymore. See some of the woodwork siding, all wood. And then from here, you go here, and this is actually another thing that's semi typical. Um, this is an old railroad car that was probably hauled out here. We're actually not that far away from where the old Northern Pacific used to run or excuse me, the old Sioux line used to run. Um, and so a lot of places you'll find old abandoned cars that have been moved to farms and things like that and made into sheds. And then of course they fall into disrepair. I believe that's an old car on its side there. I'm not exactly sure what kind. It's on the other side of a fence line so I won't they're getting into that. And then there's this house. And the windows and everything have been busted out. Obviously not been used in a very, very long time. Um, again, I would not enter the building, but it's just a beautiful example of architecture of the time. And the lines in the back and the sheds from some time ago. And apparently there's still some power going to some of it. At least the big drop lines are there. I'll move on over here. Unfortunately in some parts of the state. This is kind of all that's left of a lot of different communities. These trees have obviously grown up far larger than they were intended to. To straddle the entry into the home. tends to go fairly quickly is the chimney. But there's just this little grouping here of church and home. What showed me also is that there's another little building here. I'm not sure exactly what that is, but of course the green elevator and another home. I'm going to stop this and then I'll move towards the elevator and we can look at some of the other, other things.